giving death to birth of a zombie cheerleader. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. What were you doing? That was my moment. Well, you always get the spotlight. I'm co-captain and I should get it too. If we want to win, I need to be the center of attention. I'm the only reason we have a shot of winning nationals this year. Rebecca? What? Isn't that your boyfriend? You know what? Practice is over. Grab your pom-poms and get out of here. Tom must want to meet me under the bleachers. Tom, I'm happy to see you, but you better have a good excuse as to why you ghosted me this last month and staying at your grandma's house is not good enough. Tom? Tom, what, what happened to you? Wait, Tom! Wait, get away! Ah! Poor girl, shame she died so young. These attacks keep happening every month. <gasps> What's going on? Where am I? Do this. I don't want to be a zombie. It's bad for my skin. What's going on? Sam I think this is my funeral. Those are my teammates. They're going to be so happy to see me. Maybe they can help me become human again. I know it's only been a few weeks since Rebecca died, but I'm kind of glad she's not here. Right? She was so mean to me no matter how hard I practiced. I'm just glad you get to be cheer captain. What? Em and Beth are glad that I'm gone? They're probably just jealous because they couldn't be as good as me. Wait, is that my boyfriend Tom? The one who killed me? I could have sworn he was a zombie. Hey, babe. <laughs> not a big turnout. Guess I'm not surprised. And he's dating Emma? <gasps> this can't be happening. I'm ready to put Rebecca behind us. Let's go. Wait, Sam fam, do none of my friends like me? You know what? I don't need them anyways. I was always cooler. Where'd that locker come from? A new freak. Another zombie? Just what we needed. Oh. Hey, new girl, what are you doing? You're gonna be late. What? For what? Come on. Late on your first day? Just because you're dead doesn't mean you can cut class, Rebecca. Where am I? Monster Academy, of course. After a student becomes a monster, they transfer here. Well, actually, I need to get back to my school because we have cheerleading nationals soon. Oh, no, 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 you're not leaving. You're a monster now. Why don't you introduce yourself to the rest of the class? Hi, I'm Rebecca. I am captain of my cheerleading team and I was the most popular girl at my school. <laughs> popular? A zombie could never be popular. They're totally gross. Have you smelled yourself lately? At this school, Rebecca's not popular at all. She's not gonna like that. Be nice, class. She wasn't always a smelly zombie. Why don't you take a seat, Rebecca? Brain eater. Today, class, we'll be brewing potions! Everyone take out your cauldrons and partner up. We can be partners, Rebecca. What's werewolf and witch's problem with me? It's not you, it's just zombies aren't cool here. They're the popular kids. You know what it's like. I was popular and I never acted like that. Did I? Today, we'll be brewing invisibility potions. Just combine the fairy tears with the moonstone extract. So you don't mind being partners with an uncool zombie like me? No, I don't care what those bullies think. Being a cheerleader captain seems pretty cool to me. Cheerleading was fun, but honestly, I was kind of mean to my teammates. I wish I could apologize to them right now. Let's see what's next. Let's 
to teach this zombie that her kind isn't welcome here. <laughs> I have the perfect thing. I think the witch just did something to her potion. Which witch? There's only one witch. Rebecca, something's not quite right here. What's happening? Stay back! The potion's about to- Oh no! Look at the zombie. Just when we thought she couldn't get any uglier. She's not gonna look like that when she comes out of the program, will she? What a freak. <laughs> <laughs> what are they Face. talking about? Face. Face. Ah! What did you do to me? I hate it here. Rebecca, wait. <laughs> Come on, girl. Uh, as if being here isn't bad enough. Pull it together, Rebecca. You can't let them see you cry because then they win and you can know that that happened. You are the most popular girl at school. You used to have gray hair, most of your teeth, and you're not going down without a fight. A heart? Eyeballs? Why do brains actually look good? Rebecca, over here. Here. Drink this. It'll undo the spell. Really? It worked! You're really good at this potion stuff. Well, science kind of runs in my family. <laughs> what are they doing with their hands? I think she likes him. <laughs> in the program. Oh, look. The freaks are flirting. We're at a school for monsters, and somehow this is the grossest thing I've seen. That's it. I'm giving these monsters a taste of their own medicine. Rebecca, don't. You only make things worse. Now it's time for her to get payback. You guys think you're so funny, don't you? <laughs> oh, did I hurt your little feelings? Oh, look. The big bad cheater came over to put you in your place. <laughs> More like put it in your face. The witch just froze her drink. Oh, oh no. no. now. Get used to it. I run this school, so I'm calling the shots. Got it? <laughs> I want to go home. <laughs> Wait! You guys are so mean. <laughs> go cry to your girlfriend about it. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you okay? The witch is right. I am a nobody. That's not true. But the worst part is I saw myself in her. What do you mean? I mean, at my old school, I was just like her. I was popular, I bossed everyone around, and I bullied anyone that tried to stand up to me. I don't believe that. The Rebecca I know is strong and brave. No, it's true. Even my old friends secretly hated me. I need to apologize. If only there was a way for me to go home and make things right. <laughs> hey, hey, you, you don't need to cry. Maybe Professor Bloodworth knows what to do. Really? Can you take me to him? Yeah, let's uh, let's go see him. Professor Bloodworth, is there any way I could go home? I'm sorry, Rebecca, but you can only enter the living world every full moon. Those are the monster's rules. That's it? That's only like once a month. Could be worse. I mean, Professor Bloodworth is cursed to teach in this school for the rest of eternity. It's true. I can never leave these halls. In fact, I haven't had fresh human blood in centuries. If you've been here this long, you must know a way that I can turn back into a human. Yes, well, there is a way, but it's too risky. What is it? I'll do anything. There is a ritual that can reverse the curse, but it requires you to bring every person you've ever wronged into the ritual chamber and earn their forgiveness. Everyone I've wronged? That must be my old teammates. So all I have to do is bring them back here and get them to forgive me. Rebecca has a chance to be human again? And not look so... dead. But you only get one chance. And if the ritual fails, you lose your soul and die. For real. You can't, Rebecca! It's too risky. If that's what I have to do, then I'll do it. I was pretty awful to my old teammates. I just need to figure out a way to get them to forgive me. I don't like this plan, but if there's no changing your mind, at least let me come help. Then we gotta go. We have a lot of work to do. There's something weird about that teacher. Maybe because he's a vampire. So I need to get my old friends to forgive me so I can reverse the curse. What'd you even do that you had to apologize for? I wasn't exactly the best teammate or friend. So here's the plan. I am gonna choreograph the best cheerleading routine. Now help me practice. 
Okay. Five, six, seven, eight. How's this gonna help? I bullied some of my teammates and left my best friends out of the routine. Why? I guess I was just worried that they'd become more popular than me. So you're a bit of a control freak then? Exactly. So if I can choreograph a routine that features both of them and step down as captain, then maybe they'll know I'm truly sorry. That's a great idea. And I think it's really cool that you want to make it up to your friends. Thanks, Frankenstein. Rebecca and Frankenstein would be the perfect match. Except for she's going to be human again and she already has a husband. Not in the program. Hey, yeah, but shouldn't you be getting going? Today's the day of the full moon. You're right. You're right. Wish me luck. Go team. I really hope this works. in the real world. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Sam fam, there they are. Now I need to convince them to come with me back to Monster Academy so I can start the ritual. Wish me luck. There is no way that she's gonna get her friends to go back with her to Monster Academy. Why am I so nervous to talk to them? Maybe it's because they think I'm dead, which I'm not, which I kind of am, but not for long. I just have to do this. But it's step clap. Are you sure? Because step spin clap feels better. We need to come up with the perfect routine for nationals. Ugh. Emma, Beth. Ew, who is this bum? Uh, I'm sorry, this is a close practice. It's me, Rebecca. Rebecca's dead. That's not funny. No, it really is me. I'm just a little less alive than I was before. I'm sorry. What? Ugh, it's a trick. The real Rebecca would never apologize. If I wasn't Rebecca, then how would I have this? Okay? I, I just wanted to say that I'm sorry. I was awful to you guys, and I want to make it up to you. I have a surprise that I think could really help you guys win nationals. I can't trust her. But she said she can help us with nationals, and she was always the best at choreography routines. We need the help. Okay, we'll see your surprise, but I have my eye on you. <sighs> okay, thank you. You guys will not regret it. Now follow me. Oh yeah, yes she did. She might be this program after all. Become human again. Come on. So, here it is. Rebecca, what is this? Is this another one of your mean pranks? No, it's not a prank. Just follow me. You will not believe where this locker goes. There's no time to explain, just follow me. So, this is the surprise. What is this place, and what is that? What, you haven't seen a green man made of scavenged body parts before? Ew, no. This is my friend Frankenstein. And you're at Monster Academy. And our professor said if I apologize for all the awful things I did to you, then I can become human again. So here goes. I'm sorry for how I treated you. You both are amazing cheerleaders. I was just being selfish because I was worried you'd become more popular than me. <coughs> and, <coughs> and, uh, Beth, you'll be a better co-captain and lead the team better than I ever could. Wow, well, thanks, Rebecca. And for you, Emma, I choreographed a routine that will feature all of your best moves. All of both of your best moves. So what do you say? Will you at least give the routine a try? Let's try. Yeah, I guess we can try it. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one. Woo! Yeah! That was incredible! Woo! You girls killed it. Emma, this is the routine we need to win nationals. Yeah, I guess. So, what do you think? Do you forgive me? Do you think it worked? Do you think they'll forgive her? This is stressing me out! I forgive you, Rebecca. <sighs> Thanks, Beth. <laughs> And you, Emma? Um, the routine is nice and all, but you're only doing this so you can become human again. That's not true. I'm sorry, I don't think I can forgive you, Rebecca. I don't think you're apologizing for the right reason. Emma. I'm sorry, Rebecca. But being a monster isn't all that bad. I can teach you everything you need to know. <laughs> oh, Rebecca, you're so stupid. You actually think you could reverse your curse from something as silly as forgiveness? <laughs> you can't? No! 
Then why'd you make a duel of this? Why indeed? Because I haven't had fresh blood in thousands of years. And you have brought some straight to my doorstep. The teacher lied to her and he wants to kill her friends. Those are my friends, you can't. Friends? This one just rejected you. Rebecca, what's going on? Get us out of here. For doing me this favor, I'll let you in on a little secret. There actually is a way to reverse the curse. How? Oh, well, to become human, all you have to do is create a new monster to take your place. So, if I create a zombie, then I can become human again. Why do you think you were bit in the first place? That's why Tom was a human at my funeral. He attacked me so he could become human again. Well, that worked. Tom? As in my boyfriend Tom? You mean my boyfriend Tom that you stole when I died? Clearly they are not really your friends. Now look, you turn one into a zombie, I get the other one. Everyone wins. Then I'll just have to kill you as well and make sure you're not resurrected this time. Drink this and run! What? No. What? Wait! Sad. Where did they go? Oh, the potions of invisibility! Why am I such a good teacher? No! No! I gotcha! Fight no! Slow. Let me go! Hold still! Help! Help. Oh. done better than that. Frankenstein, you saved me and my friends. It was nothing, really. The last time I was in a situation like that, I ended up being turned into a zombie by my boyfriend. Well, maybe you should get a better boyfriend then. I think I have someone in mind. Well, that was crazy. I'm sorry for dating Tom, even though I thought you were dead. And if he turned Rebecca into a zombie, imagine what he would do to us. Ugh, right? I also want to apologize for not forgiving you. I hadn't believed that you'd changed, but you really have. Thank you. <laughs> Do you want to come back with us? Maybe we can just grab a movie? Uh, Tom won't be invited. Yeah. <laughs> I would love that. Frankenstein, would you? That sounds great, but only zombies can go out in four minutes. I have to stay here, but you should go and catch up with your friends. Come on, let's go back to the real world. We will put some makeup on. Nobody will know that you're a zombie. Um, actually, you know what? You guys go. I'm gonna stay here. She's gonna stay as a monster? Are you kidding me? Oh, I get it. You two have fun. <laughs> So, uh, does that mean you'll stay at Monster Academy? Only if you teach me that invisibility potion. <laughs> I think I can find time in my busy schedule. Oh, there are that Pull her out! Oh. oh, guess she knows it already. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I did my first death to birth program! Frankenstein is not real! Okay, Zamfam, if you made it this far, make sure to comment below your whole with no explanation and click and watch this video right here. No one be Frankenstein this year!